my youtube channel modi mechanical engineering tutorials in this video i would like to explaining about basics about metal joining process so in metal joining process the basic question is what is welding so let us start to understanding the welding process with the introduction so welding is a process for joining different materials so that materials it will be ferrous non ferrous or you can say simple way similar metals or dissimilar kind of materials so welding is defined as joining of two similar or dissimilar kind of materials so the large bulk of the materials that are welded are metals and their alloys although the term welding is also applied to joining of other materials such as thermoplastics welding joints on to the different metals or you can see different alloys with the help of a number of processes in which heat is supplied either electrically or by means of gas torch so into the welding process either you can use arc welding process or you can use a different kind of torch that will be generating with the different kind of gases in order to join two or more pieces of metals together by one of the welding processes so the most essential requirement is heat so there will be the basic requirements into the any welding process sometimes pressure may be applied or it may be not applied so generally that will be depends upon the selection of the metal joining processes since a slight gap usually exists between the edges of the workpiece so at the time a filler metal is used to supply additional materials to fill the gap between the base metal or parent metal but into the welding can be also carried out without using of the filler metal so generally that will be also depends upon the selection of the different welding processes so the filler metal is melted into the gap combines with the molten metal of the workpiece and upon the solidification forms an integral part of the weld now i would like to discussing some of the standard definitions and that will be given by american welding society aws so as per the aws welding is defined as a localized collisions of metals or non metals so welding you can also performing on to the metals as well as non metals produce either by the heating the materials to the suitable temperature we already discussing that because heating that will be the essential conditions into any welding process then after with or without application of pressure or by the application of pressure alone that will be depends and with or without use of the filler materials so basically the aws it will be concentrate on to the three things first conditions that will be the essential conditions and that will be heat second two conditions that will be considering as a application of pressure then that will be the filler materials so these three we already discussing now some more important part of the welding and that will be the welding terminology so let's see so this is the figures so in that case that will be the parent metal then electrodes so in between two parent metals or base metals it will be the gap here into the figure arc is being struck between workpiece and you can say the electrode or sometimes into the gas welding process so that will be no arc is being generating but by the application of flame there will be increasing the temperature but what happens by the application of any welding process so either it will be electrically supply or it will be by the gas flame so in that case it will be the 
fusion kind of welding process. So into the welding process there will be a molten form of weld structure and electrode or can say filler materials and it will be making a weld pool between the two base metal or you can say parent metal. Now starting with the first base metal. So it will be the simplest task into the welding process the metal to be joined or you can say cut each term as a base metal here into the figure it will be indication as a parent metal. So you should write base metal or parent metal so in simple way whatever you want to join that metal it will be considering as a base metal either it will be similar either it will be dissimilar either it will be ferrous non-ferrous or you can say metallic or non-metallic it may be possible anything then second thing and that will be also important part into the any welding process so penetration so just you can see the figure so in that case the depth up to which the weld metal combines with the base metal so that height or you can say depth it will be known as a penetration. So into figure that molten form of the base metal and weld metal it will be filling the gap between the two parent metal. So that depth or you can say in simple way height it will be indication as a penetration of the weld. So that will be achieving by the number of passes of the weld. After penetration backing so during the welding process the backing is provided or you can say that will be used to support at the root side of the weld metal so that will be control the penetrations so it will be act as a backup or you can say supporting systems to the molten form of the metals after backing there will be the also one important part and that will be the root preparation or you can see root. So root is defined as at a point at which two pieces to be joined by the welding are nearest. So that will be known as a root. So just you can see it will be into the figure. After root there will be one more things weld toe. So basically weld toe it is the junction between the weld face and base metal. So that will be known as a weld toe. So that will be one kind of separate out the boundary of your weld face and base metal. Weld face. So just you can see into the figure that excess weld metal or you can say that excess weld metal which is exposed surface of the weld so that will be known as a weld face so if you like this then subscribe and share modi mechanical engineering tutorials thank you so much and keep watching